I'm Jason. I'm Todd. This is our little child, Ziggy. Say hello, Ziggy. Hi, Ziggy. And we're the Vamping Guys. Hey guys, we're back from the cruise and we're back from our vacation. So we're gonna start posting some videos again. And uh, we only have like three more days until we close on the house. Everything went perfect. All cash buyers, appraisal went fine, inspection went fine, no issues at all. The glamping gods are looking over us. So uh, I just thought it'd be fun to show you one more little uh, walk around of everything that we have gotten finished with the final, final phase of the house. And then um, after that, I'm just gonna show you some fun little uh, snippets of our cruise. So uh, I hope you guys enjoy, sit back, and we'll have some more videos coming up next week. I'm gonna be posting one about the RV resort uh, that we have decided on. And you guys are gonna to get to see our brand new fifth wheel, Woohoo! So uh, thanks a lot guys for coming along and let's go for a quick little walk around the house and then I'm sure you guys wanna see some of our fun vacation. So we have a friend coming and getting all of our furniture. I have got everything all put out in the garage but we have one friend that's taking all of this right here. And then we have another friend who is coming by and taking the TV and entertainment center. We just have a few little things left. We could literally pack up in probably like three hours. So I thought I'd just show you the inside of the house real quick. But we have the kitchen completely emptied out. Nothing's in the cabinets. Right up here is the dining room table and bar back in the corner. And our next door neighbor is taking this. So we're gonna be helping her uh, tomorrow, moving this out of the house. And oh my God, look at this. Our house is empty. There's nothing in here. We have everything off the walls, spackled, painted. It's so weird because there's like an echo now inside the house. And my neighbor, she also is taking one of our couches and her husband wants the recliner. All right, we'll go in here real fast. Bathroom's completely empty. And you can see the office is completely empty. My neighbor's also taking the desk and the chair. And all we have to do is just pack up the computer and some of the cables down under the desk and that's it. So uh, again, guys, I just wanted to thank all of you for following us on our downsizing journey. We have a lot more videos to share with you in the future about the next phase. And we're definitely gonna be virgins living in the fifth wheel. So you'll be getting to watch us as we film a lot of our you know, fifth wheel firsts with all of you. And uh, we hope uh, we'll definitely get some good feedback from all of you guys. Okay, on to the cruise. Hi everybody, we're waiting in line. The most exciting part of the cruise ship is always waiting in line to get on it. So I know, we we're so ready for a cocktail. Seriously. Here we are, the Norwegian sun. Hi, how are you? Oh, we're good. I just washed my hands. We're good. Hi. Woo! Yeah! Twerk it. Twerk it, girl. Twerk it. Twerk it. Hey, guys. Yay! We are back in familiar territory. We're on the boat. We're on the boat. One little cruise tip for all of you. Even though it's a seven-day cruise, we have been able to pack very very lightly because we just mix and match a lot and most of the time you're just in shorts and a shirt or in your bathing suit 
we always just do carry-on and then we have two little carry-on arm bags and we can go right to our room because a lot of times they want you to go up and hang out and party on the pool deck while you're waiting for your bags to be delivered but we have found out years ago that if you do carry on you don't have to check in anything and you can go right to your room get settled in and then just focus on having a great time and partying speaking of partying this is the dazzles nightclub this is the disco dazzles right it's dazzles dazzles yeah hi hi thank you how are you and everyone here is just so friendly okay guys so here's the atrium we're actually going to sign off for a minute and uh we'll uh bring you guys into the room and give you a quick little tour of the room while we unpack check out our cabin we got one with a porthole i've got the curtains closed because uh it's still kind of sunny out and uh, i don't want to wash out the video but i just wanted you guys to see our cute little room uh, we have actually been on this boat before about uh, three to four years ago We took a cruise on this exact boat the Norwegian Sun. We fell in love with this boat It just has everything that we love and it's a smaller boat and we really like that too. So uh, it's not like crazy chaotic with like huge crowds uh, You don't really have to wait in line to get a drink or wait too much uh, for uh, your seating for dinner because the cool thing with Norwegian is that it's freestyle cruising, which means you can just basically go uh, to the two main dining rooms and just go to dinner whenever you feel like it. And uh, it's also casual, as long as it's, you know, uh, just uh, nice, uh, no flip-flops or tank tops, uh, you can pretty much uh, sit in the main dining room and have a lovely dinner. All right, guys, see you later. All aboard! Hi everybody, we're doing a drill that I think is called a muster, so we're going to muster up some stamina to get through this so we can get a drink. So let's do it! Hey everybody, well, the mustering is over. It is past, it is behind us. Would the past tense be mustered? Anyway, we have finished with the ball, the lat, so we are now able to finally enjoy our first cocktail of the cruise. And apparently, we got a two-for-one deal because our bartender made so much of this drink that he just gave us two glasses. Hey guys, so we made it on the boat. Here's a shot of Miami from the distance. It is our first full day on the boat. We are getting ready to arrive at Nassau. We have actually been there quite a few times, so another cool little tip to share. I'm sure a lot of you who go on cruise ships a lot, if uh, you stay on the boat, when the boat is docked in the port city, everybody pretty much is off the boat, and you have the whole boat to yourself. So that's what we're gonna be doing today. We've been to Nassau quite a few times, so we're gonna take advantage of having all this wonderful emptiness on the boat. I think we're gonna come down to the pool a little bit later, kinda chill. But the other great thing in the mornings, you know, the boat's not uh, that busy right now. So it's kinda nice because uh, it'll be a little bit more quiet. Here's uh, the atrium. And it's really pretty. They have uh, these cool little glass elevators and the steps. And it goes up pretty high. But you can take the elevator all the way up to the pool deck. And then this is the wind jammer bar. And uh, this is uh, one of our favorite hangouts as well when we went on the Norwegian Sun for uh, our first cruise about three years ago. Uh, we really loved hanging out back in here. Very chill. 
But it's got like a really cool, like old school vibe. But we like to come down here. They have live music at nighttime. Uh, sometimes uh, they have somebody playing the piano, which is right down here at the end. Uh, we didn't come down last night, but they uh, had a guitar player here last night. And this is kind of cool. It's a little uh, model of a ship. I don't know, maybe that's actually uh, called the Windjammer after uh, the name of the bar. Who knows? Oh, and this is really neat. They have like a little library center. See, so check that out. Okay, and we're almost on the aft part of the boat. Uh, and that's why I like this restaurant right down here because uh, it's kind of hidden. Look at this sculpture, isn't that pretty? This is just the coolest boat. We love this boat so much. And we actually just found out that uh, after this cruise, they're going to be taking this boat into dry dock. And they do, are doing a complete remodel on this boat. Isn't that pretty though? Look at that. And right up here is the dining room entrance. Hi, good morning. How are you? Hi, good morning. Okay. Yay, see, look at this. There's like hardly anybody in the dining room. Isn't that pretty? That's what I love about coming to the dining room for breakfast. You know, it's uh, a lot of people don't even realize that it's open for breakfast. Oh, thank you. Are you gonna be my server? Uh, no. No, okay. If you want, I will serve you. Oh no, I'm good, I'm good, thank you. Yeah, I'm gonna look that way. Thank you. Oh, wonderful. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, you're very sweet. Thank you. Enjoy. Thank you. And right here's the window out to Nassau. So anyway, uh, I think I'm going to sign off for a few minutes uh, while the server comes over. Java House, they have great coffee, but it's also a full on bar. We're at the Bistro 
which is a wonderful French restaurant on board the Norwegian Sun. We actually went, went here last time that we were on board and uh, we had a great meal, so we're back again. And they've got all sorts of really interesting entrees and they even have a rosé wine from a town in France called Roussillon that I actually visited. So I'm excited to try that wine again. We're excited to, Jason's gonna get some wonderful food and uh, we're just ready to dig in and have a great time. Hey everybody, we're on a tender boat and we are heading to Georgetown at Grand Cayman Island. Can't wait to check out what looks like a beautiful town and grab some lunch and meet some locals. I know it's very, very loud here too. But I'm gonna pan around real quick and show you guys the tender. It's a little rocky too. Yes, and you know what they say, if the boat's a rockin', don't come a knockin'. Hi guys. We're on the tender. We're going to Georgetown. and go explore but I thought this was kind of cool just to give you guys a little shot of the Georgetown cruise ship port area. Invasion. They just busted out an accordion and took over the entire aft deck. And I approve. Yes, uh, we definitely approve. This is fun. Oh, I know, right? I wish I knew what the song is. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. Today is day seven, our last day on the ship. Today is a day at sea, and we have the time change. So it's still a little bit dark out, but it's about seven in the morning. And I got up a little bit early because I wanted to do a really nice little video of the sunrise across the ocean. Hopefully it'll be really beautiful. But uh, just wanted to show you the observation lounge. This is one of our favorite places. And uh, the nice thing about getting up really early on the ship is that it's very, very quiet. We were in Cozumel yesterday. And unfortunately, we ended up staying on the boat. And the reason being is that they only had three tender boats available. So, we were in Cozumel from 10 until 5, and they were still calling people to come down to the tender like 
by two o'clock. So unfortunately, uh, because of the tender situation, we did not get off and we decided to stay on the boat. So I don't have any photos or video of the actual island of Cozumel. We're a little bit disappointed, but what can you do when you're on a cruise? You just kind of go with the flow. But hopefully uh, the sunrise video will make up for it. So you guys enjoy. <music> Thank you, thank you, thank you. Leave a comment to say hi. If you like us, please subscribe. And if you don't, our little fluffy dog will attack you. <laughs>